Welcome. Today we're going to make a really easy uh, cannellini bean dip with uh, a little bit of pesto sauce, a little bit of garlic, lemon juice, and cayenne pepper. What do you think of that? Right here, you're going to need a food processor, right? So we're just going to place the cannellini beans right in there. Remember, this is just going to be very simple. We're just going to add an already prepared uh, pesto, basil pesto but um, I'm, I'll give you the recipe and it's going to be in our website. So you're not gonna miss that one. And it's actually a very good one. So um, just make sure that um, your pesto would have some oil. So depending how much oil the pesto would have, just try to omit the, the amount of oil that you might be using if necessary. If not, just use an oil. So that would be okay. Right here, I have my garlic and my cayenne pepper. That's just gonna give that um, really nice aftertaste of sweetness, but yes, a little bit of uh, spiciness and brightness in the back of your palate. Why? Because the lemon juice, it would definitely react to that, and that's what's just going to balance out the acid content in it. So let's just go ahead and just mix it all together, right? That's all we need. So. I have it in low right now, so, because I want them just to, to start breaking them down. You can definitely speed up the, um, the speed. You can actually make it higher, put it higher, like right now. But you see, all these parts up here, nothing is happening to those things. So let's move the lid really quick. Just get these things going, right? So my oil was in uh, the extra oil. I put it in the basil pesto. So it's all combined all together right there. As you can see, uh, after a while, when you when you realize that you don't see any big particles or, or pieces of the white beans, that will be ready, right? Because you don't want to you don't want to overdo it because then you start breaking those carbohydrates, those starches, and they become really dense. So you want to avoid that, right? And right now, what you see, we just have the pesto. If you think that uh, it's too uh, too thick. Just save a little bit of the water, you know, from the cannellini, and then just add it to this. Right here, we're just gonna play two or three right here. We're just gonna use any, uh, these are triscuits. You can use any whole grain, whole wheat cracker, or either bread, or you can use a crudite. Crudite would be just raw vegetables that you can dip them into, and you're just gonna have a great time anyways. So let's just place them right there. And uh, as you can see, this is an appetizer, so you don't really want to just make, uh, make them too big. It's just gonna be um, bite size. So right there, you see, and you just place one tomato on top. And we're just gonna start building them like that, right? So, very simple. And you just want to get like half a, half a, a teaspoon. So, and that's that would be perfect. Just right there, you see. Just place them like that, like if it was a, a canal. And um, just place it right there. So we have two right now. Uh -huh. And I mean, you can you you'll see. This is a procedure that is just going to happen until your whole um, bean dip is is gone and people will be asking you for more. So, let's just add this right here. So you see how simple that was? Not even five minutes. 
So I hope that you decide to make it and have a lot of fun with your friends and family.